Well, hello there, little ladies. This is Colin. This is Brock. This is Mac. And we are doing Three Man One Pen. Three, Three Man, man one, one Pen. Three Man One Pen. The show where the points don't matter and the nonsense is uh, acceptable. It's rampant. It's rampant. It's rampant. <laughs> so, uh, really in case you haven't seen another Three Man One Pen, and by another I mean the only other one we've done. <laughs> <laughs> well, kind of. This is an episode where we take turns passing a pen. Each person gets a minute to draw whatever they want, and then they pass it to another scribble chat. Uh, Fantastic. And then they burp into the mic. So, Brock is starting with the pen right now, and he is redrawing Antarctica. I am not redrawing the Antarctica. lost episode. The lost episode of, <laughs> of Antarctica. Oh, wait, don't. That doesn't have an R. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Atlantica. Not only is Atlantis water. <laughs> Shut up and take the and pen. Not Max. ice. <laughs> All right, Max got the pen now. And you. All right, so what I was drawing was a man running. Really? Please, <laughs> please explain further. Yep, and I'll see where you guys take it from there. <clears throat> oh, my gosh. Um, looks like. I don't know what Max is doing. Yeah, I'm just as confused. That's pretty Be interesting, honest. though. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, everyone. Merry Christmas to all in Garden. Nice. This is a riveting episode, guys. I really don't know. It looks like you've got a man's face on a stick. Oh, That's gross! A oh, yeah, it is, a, it is. Oh, gosh! Why? That is disturbing! We're really good at making really creepy things. Oh, I don't want to be known for being creepy, guys. It's just so you guys know, we also do um, Happy murder, murder mystery novels. <laughs> um, All right, back past the college. So, uh, I figured this guy was uh, running away with a shrunken head. This is actually the witch doctor by Apple. Is what this is. <laughs> a by Apple on? Try, yes. Yeah, I yes. Did, I did Dick Capitan. Dick Capitan. Fine. Dick Capitan. And, uh... I'm drawing, by the way. Could be the head of anyone. Could have been an ex-lover. Could have been a uh, co-worker. Oh. Could have been a viewer. Ooh. Ooh. But... It's not. Well, that would be our only one. Yeah. yeah I was <laughs> we, oh, no! Our only viewer, <laughs> why? We took care of them. We do, we took care What's this is What are you doing? Oh my god. Hold on. What? Okay, there we go. <clears throat> Wait. Nope. <laughs> okay. Hey, that was my turn. There you go. Alright, so Brock's drawing now. So, uh, explain what was in your mind when you were drawing. Uh, the witch doctor by the death. So this is the yeah, witch doctor. All I ever think of. This is the one who created that thing. Yeah. Yeah. And, um. You know, kind of, this is kind of like a. Have you ever seen Beetlejuice? La 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 la. <laughs> That's my guess. Beetlejuice? That, that was la, 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 la. Yeah. You guys so, never watched the Beetlejuice cartoon? Uh oh. Well? Third time. Here he comes. What? Rock? Anyone? Oh, Beetlejuice! 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 <laughs> wow! <laughs> That's a sad boy. That is a sad boy. Man, I feel absolutely stupid for that now. Like, I can't believe I didn't even... That was good. No, I like that. Um, <laughs> So he's got some little tatas. Well, who said it's a he? It could yeah, be a flat no, woman. A lady. Um, Go so for it, Mac! That would be highly way, way, way to be racist. Sex dangerous. I feel really racist drawing this. Like, I think this is just full of stereotypes. That does not accurately well, they depict were, they didn't exist Haitian voodoo people. I, they didn't exist until you brought them up. Well, you said it was voodoo, right? That's a Haitian thing. Uh, you know, uh, yes. 
<laughs> Fair enough. Yes. <clears throat> Thank you. Thank so, you for so my my thing was my that terrible ignorance. <laughs> right, <you're laughs> so what I was thinking is that um, one of his favorite things to do is make clothing from uh, the skulls of pygmies. Okay. So uh, it's actually something he likes to do in his spare time. Yeah. He, uh, Definitely. He'll, yep, he'll decapitate pygmies and uh, he'll make good clothing out of them. In fact, he's got a little store. It's 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 kind of on Etsy. Yeah, know? it's it's an Etsy shop. It's, it's an Etsy shop. It's it's not too popular, but it's his thing. It's his hobby. Right. Um, yeah. 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 I started amassing a zombie horde that was following the Voodoo Doctor. I, f- I also added some scenery for <laughs> effect. <laughs> but, uh, no, I figure Voodoo Doctors, that was, I watched this thing on the Discovery Channel where they talked about if, uh, in any event, a zombie outbreak could occur, the most likely reason would be voodoo? Really? Yeah. I don't really remember exactly what happened, but it was something about the way they embalmed bodies, where, uh, they used to, the corpses would, like, sit up straight after some time, because the rigor mortis would set in. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And somehow they drew that to some zombification... Crazy. Um, I don't know exactly, but so it would be like some terrible virus. It would just be like right. Some like all these zombies came to life. I don't know. But anyways, <gasps> oh no, dude, he's a voodoo surfer, dude. Right off the island. That's dude, the smartest way to get that away. Is, that is exactly the smartest way. Yeah. So I figured he he really messed up big time. He was like, uh oh, <laughs> they are these uh, voodoo zombies are not doing as I thought they would, <laughs> and now I must flee. So Colin, what's with the surfboard? You know what? You uh, put on those zombies, and I was like, oh crap, gotta get away. Zombies can't swim? No. Well, they can, but then they become waterlogged, right? They get, like, all blurry and fat. This is the best viewer. Okay, so, yeah, that's a good point. Uh, If zombies ended up falling in the water, they'd all be floating corpses, right? But they would, like, still be able to bite you. Right? Yeah. So if you were like swimming with zombies, one found to bite you. Yeah. Right. Of course. Right. Yeah. That could be pretty lethal. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Who is it? He's back. <laughs> bark, bark. Bark, 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 bark. If anyone got that, you've been watching our videos, <laughs> and thank you. If you didn't, go watch our videos. So what I was thinking is that. My turn. This is going to be an... Oh, yeah, Max draw. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so this would be an awesome 80s movie. It was like, yeah, guys are watching like, Surf Ninjas. Oh, my God. Surf it's, Ninjas! It's totally Escape from L.A. It's <laughs> Escape from L.A. Yo, you're, you're, from you're LA. absolutely right. So, like, this is, like, so this is, like, surfing voodoo dude. But he's got to have, like, a kooky sidekick, right? Yeah. So he's got mustache shark. Or is there just mustache sharks, like, no, 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 Mustang Shark is his kooky sidekick who's like, I love the ladies, but he never gets them. What's he do? <laughs> oh. Poor guy. Poor guy. I, too, am going into voodoo. <laughs> yeah. To relieve the pain. <laughs> to relieve the pain. I don't think that's how it works, but I mean... Hey. Shut up. That is a beautiful voodoo shark. Thank, Thank you. Man. I agree. Um, I figure get a little, uh, like, a spit fire. And, uh, pass the pens. Pass me the pen. <laughs> Calvin is drawing. Um, <clears throat> I'm sorry, my voice. Brock keeps complaining that his voice is weird. Excuse me. And I just want you all to know that it's getting really annoying. I'm going to bite you. <laughs> None of us hear it three seconds. <laughs> I don't get it, because I don't hear anything. <laughs> is he, like, sipping his meat? We don't hear it. We don't hear it, Brock. That's so weird. There's nothing. Well, I can feel it. Does that make a well, difference? Get that. Junk out of your mouth. Get <laughs> junk out of your throat. That dude is... How many toes does he have? Enough to surf. Just one. give me a number. One yes. toe. So he's hanging two. And a couple on his knee. He has a couple toes on his knee and one toe on his knee. Oh. Oh, gosh. <laughs> this is actually... This is actually a prosthetic. Uh, uh, robot leg. <laughs> robot. Robot voodoo. So, Brock, is this how you wanted this to go? Um... You know what? Yes. I, w- I would say absolutely yes. When I was drawing this, I was like, robot prosthesis. Yeah, the nice thing about this, um, if no one's taking the time to... Sorry. Prosthetics. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the person who starts with the pen also ends with 
pen. Yeah. So like you start it, you finish it. Mm-hmm. It's kind of nice. It's uh, it's full circle. And then right. it becomes your responsibility. Six grade language arts. Full circle. Full circle. Full circle. No, his face, is, his nose is in full circle. What the heck? Is it? His eyes are full circle. That, that circle's full circle. That's. It's the moon. Well, no, there's two circles. Or it's the sum with a bite out of it. Oh, um, no, no. Zombie and moon. an eyeball. And oh, scary moon. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching. It was a blast. Is that Wilson? <laughs> that kind of looks like Wilson. Well, we hope you enjoyed. Yep, another episode of Three Men One Pen. Three Man One Pen. Mm-hmm. One pen. If this is us keeping it short and sweet, signing out. Peace. Nope. If you nope. like the video, like the video. <laughs> Maybe you will please leave a comment. Tell us what you think improve on or tell us what you like about it or tweet us at scribble chaps thanks for tuning in yeah bye guys <laughs> <laughs>